Every day, eight and a half million people walk through the streets of New York, travel on its subways, cross its bridges. But do they really know where they are? Walk to the end of nearly any street in Manhattan and you'll hit water. It can be hard to remember when you're standing in the middle of Times Square or stuck between stations on a stalled downtown train, but New York is one of the world's great harbor cities. When Henry Hudson first sailed into the harbor 400 years ago, what he saw was a scattering of islands set in an estuary of unrivaled natural abundance. The harbor is why people have settled on these islands for thousands of years, why a great city grew in this spot. New Yorkers live and work in what was once one of the richest and most productive ecosystems in the world. And the engineer of that ecosystem was the oyster. More than 220,000 acres of reefs provided habitat for a dizzying variety of marine species. And the oysters themselves acted as the lungs of the harbor, filtering its water and ensuring its health. It filled the dining rooms and bellies of our city, nurturing our people as well as our land. But by 1970, all that had changed. Until just a few years ago, the harbor you met when venturing to our shoreline was effectively dead, thanks to overfishing, decades of industrial pollution, and the dumping of untreated sewage. I'm Giovanna Kupek, New York City native and Billion Oyster Project crew member, excited to tell you our harbor is making a comeback. A revolution of life, starting with the passing of the Clean Water Act in 1972 and continuing today through our restoration work at Billion Oyster Project. Our nonprofit aims to restore 1 billion oysters to New York Harbor by the year 2035, and in the process, reach hundreds of thousands of our city's students through restoration-based science education programs, and engage thousands of New Yorkers through public volunteering programs. Over 15,000 students, educators, and volunteers like you have helped Billion Oyster Project restore 100 million oysters and 15 acres of reef since 2014. Now we are expanding, reaching out to invite hundreds of public schools across the five boroughs to help in the restoration of our natural waterway, as well as offering New Yorkers from every walk of life the opportunity to donate their time, expertise, and resources in this great endeavor. A restored oyster population will filter our harbor, cleaning it for us and for our aquatic neighbors. Restored reefs will provide real estate for an abundance of species, Rebuilding an ecosystem as diverse as the city above. That's me, by the way. But our work is about more than a healthier and richer estuary. It's about us, the New Yorkers, who have learned through participating in our restoration efforts to care for our city's greatest natural resource, our waterways, our harbor. We New Yorkers need to remember who we are. We're not just workers or consumers, clients or employees. We're not even just moms and dads sons and daughters, students and teachers and citizens. We're also islanders. We're people who live together along shore. This is our harbor, and it's time for us to reconnect. Learn how you can join Billion Oyster Project and reconnect to the harbor, your harbor, that's been there all along. <laughs>